listening to see me. All right. So I am doing. First thing I do is brush it out. I use this brush. As y'all can see, it's kind of like shorter. Because this was a bundle. This was a bundle that I had gotten from Only Raw Hair. And I believe it's a 16 inch. So. I never used it because I left 16, went to 18, and went to, then went to 20. <laughs> so, I am um, Decided that for my birthday I'll do the the short version. The most sixteen. I mean the less sixteen. Because the most I want was twenty. Okay. We are going to brush it out. This is considered a detangler brush. Got it from Family Dollar. It has a, it has a little small brush this color, kind of. So, regular. So I'm gonna take this side. And twist it up. I don't comb or do nothing to this time. Yet. So. Make sure we get all. Okay, so what I have to do. So, <coughs> I use this to silk infusing. Just take whatever you feel. I ain't gonna tell you, some people say a quarter, a dime size. Whatever I feel like putting in my hair at that time. That's what I do. And then I put it all, all the way through. Okay, so now let me tell you about the hair. So the back pieces is the 16 inches. This piece is 18. This is a frontal. I got two different companies in my hair. The back is only more here. The front is unique here. The back comes from the internet uh, um, supplier. The front comes from a supplier as well. But they are located in Brooklyn, downtown Brooklyn, on Barn Street. So if you care to check it out, the name of it is Unique. A unique um unique um 
the extensions. Um, what is it? Unique version here extensions. So now we take this comb and we comb it through. Okay, so I usually go diagonally like that. And I take this piece, turn it up, and twist it. And bring it over on that side right there. Usually I get another clip, but I put that under there. So I'll take another sip of coffee. I'm going to go diagonally again to the back. Try to make it a little bit small. Twist that. I get a small one. And clip that up. So now, I either get this brush or this comb. This is supposed to be a double face. It's supposed to, because it's both my book. So, I'm still trying to use it. And I have a um, TS single pass. And it's supposed to mean you go through one time. And there we go. I don't really have to go through again, but just to just for straightening purposes. I don't go on. Okay, so that's nice and straight. So can straight some go back to the next one. <clears throat> Got it out of the way again. Probably can still see the wave from the curl. And half the time when I straighten it, I wind up going back doing another curl. So, I'll keep it together. I'm going to do a straight look. I think I'm going to do a straight look for my birthday. And the good thing about it is even. I hate to, you know, I had the other hand I had it, I had gotten it cut in long layers, so there were some pieces that was longer, but it was a good person. I like to go in and get my hair done once I Get my hair done by cut. See, cut is very important to me because I spend a lot of money for this hair, and I don't want nobody just cutting because they either jealous or they want to mess up my hair. So the first time I went to the person, I had. I think I had, I may have 20 inches, but it was very, very thick. And I mean, I could do something with it, but 
it was kind of hard because it had a lot of weight to it. So, I went to this lady. And it was a different lady. Different girl. They young girls. I call them ladies because, you know, that is what they are. But, um, the first lady that cut it, she took off a lot of hair. And, and it was long layers at that time, too. But it didn't look bad. Because they layered, so when they fall, you see the layers more when you, when you curl it. You don't see it too much when... I mean, unless you're really looking, you know? Because you can see it here. The short, the long. But I didn't get this one cut yet. Let me see which one. I'm trying to see because I got two on here. Let me see. Which one I do? Okay. So I haven't learned how to do the voiceover yet. I know it's in, I know it's in, um, I, I movies. But since I'm not really a YouTuber, I didn't really pay attention to doing all that. But, That curve, you still see the curve in it. I got another brush, I gotta find it. I know I got another one somewhere. I think I bought this from Amazon. Oh, I probably bought it from Poshmark. I gotta check. Because it's supposed to be two, and somebody broke it. I mean. Tell you. You just want to want to own up. See, that's why a lot of people go into hell. To be honest with you, because untruthfulness and lying is a part of things that the Lord don't want us to have in us. So we're supposed to be truthful to one another. So we're supposed to treat our neighbors as we would want to be treated. So truthfulness is in it. Honesty is in it. The Bible say, lie not one to another, seeing that you have put off the old man with his deeds. And that put on the new man. So that's why I always be trying to be truthful. Often they be telling some lies. And if I say something, no, let me explain something. If I say something and it be, it may not, I may not know that it may have been the wrong thing to say. It be untruthful. So all untruthfulness is a lie, right? So. I'm lying. But what I mean by that is that sometimes you may say something real quickly. Like somebody say, did you move this? And you may say, no, you know you moved it, but you didn't move it under the pretense of what they're thinking. So you're not pretending to say that you didn't move it to cover up a lie. You're saying it because they may say, did you move this over here? I don't know why it's moved over here because... I, I needed it for this and that. So you don't really know what the reason why they're saying, asking me that. So quickly, you'll say, no, I didn't move it. But, you know, you don't finish this. No, I didn't move it for that reason. You just say, no, I don't move it. And you just told a lie. So a lot of times, not a lot of times, let me correct that. Sometimes that happens to me. And I'll be like, wait a minute. Let me correct this. That's not true. I did move it. 
but not for the reason that you're indicating. I moved it because, you know, I am um, meant it was in the way or something on that fashion. I don't understand. It's hot, though. I don't understand. Like it's doing that, but we know it's doing something because you can see the straightening. Seeing it doesn't pull. So if you got, if you have a, a what's in there? That's pulling. A flat iron that's pulling in here, you don't need it. You're not supposed to pull it. That age, I got it. No, no, no. I get this brush. This is from, oh, this is from Diane. I had one that was a Lumi, and this one is very good. I had a long time. It makes it nice, nice and silky. All right, so now we're going to we're going to pull out some more here. So that is considered the back. Now again, I'm going diagonally, and now we're in the front. Now. We're this up here. Okay. So now we go diagonally. Okay. Put this over here. And if I think it's a little bit too much here, then I split it in half. You can tell I got a, a piece of hair that does not go into that. So we bring that over here. So actually, we got another piece that does not go down. So if you pay attention, the hair split itself if it's not a part of it. And being that I can't really see the back too much. I can't tell what part of the head goes in what. So I have to just wait until, you know, just pay attention. Yeah, I still see that curl in there. I gotta pay attention and see if the head separates. separates and that means that I'm putting some here into the bunch that's not a part of it. really doesn't pull, doesn't snag. And go like that to see if any curl parts. When you curl your hair, your hair wraps around the curler. And it leaves kind of like a dent or a wave in it. Just so I'm able to tell. I'm gonna do this now because then I gotta get the. I wonder why. Um, let me finish this. Huh? I'm gonna do it now so when I go to get the kids, I can get ready and, and leave. You know. Because I don't 
think we have it over there so far. Am I know. We got Priya. Oh no, we we'll put one. We're gonna have to step on that Priya week. Thinking it's a Priya week. Okay, so we're gonna separate this a little bit because it's a little bit too thick. straightening when it's short. When it's real long, the straightness so you know, unless it's bone straight. Okay. So I know the top kind of shade because I dyed it. Let me see if I want to go across it this way. again straight as it can get.
Other hand, the 20 inch hand that I got, it gave you two extra inches. So that means it was actually 22 inches. So they were saying that when you cut it, if you take the two inches off, you'll get your, your um, 20 inches. But I think she cut it. I think she cut four inches off because she did the long layers and then she showed me in the back and she was like, it's all right. Uh, do you want it shorter? So I said shorter, so she cut off another two inches probably. Okay, so now I'm doing the other side. This side I always feel was a little bit thicker. But I think it's evened out this time. because they don't have to go in there and cut it so she can move the frontal forward because it was too far back. Where I thought it was. So you can see that I didn't too much straighten this one because my Curling iron is a baby list and it straightens as it's curling. So I didn't mess with this side too much. And as you see, this side is a little bit more thicker because they still have the natural wave when the first was put in. <coughs> separate and then oops wait 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 you don't want to mix up the hair so we'll take a clip so now we'll go through you know see the straightness, the shiny in it. They say don't put too much because then it'll have that grease look, but I think it kind of helps with the um the straightness. Okay, so now I'm going to And I'm 
look so cute. It makes me don't want to shave it. So these are also being diagonally. And I kind of like started the nape. And then with my sofa. Alright, so I need another one. So we gotta go up here. Alright. So I kinda feel like mine's kinda hard this side. Probably because I'm not a lefty. I can't really do it. But we're gonna get it done. Yeah. Yeah, I gotta go this way. I gotta put the mushrooms in. Okay. See, it makes it kind of hard. I'm gonna get it. I'm gonna get it. See, the coin is kind of easier. Um, it's hard because I want to get to the root. Okay. All right, it's coming out. Back together. Because I need it like this. I want to learn myself. Go back that home. I'm the curl here. So I need both parts for that awkward hand. I see one thing about this only rule here is that if I start sweating, it's going to freeze up because it's 100% raw. And raw means that it's right off of a donor's head. It's not processed. So since it's not processed, it's not going to stay straight.
So, I'll do all the straightening and then I go outside and it's hot. I was like, I'm straightening. This is fine with me, but I kind of like it like that. And just the sweat, because I'm sweating back here. So I know it's going to get thick. So you see where it separates? Can you all see it? See that separation? So that's where I will go in it. And that will be considered another, another section. Cause you want to get it as straight as you can. Kind of like, you kind of hit my ear there. straight till it's time, about an hour before it's time for me to go, and then I'll see if I want to wear it straight all the way, so you just got a little box, you know, see, I think this side going to still have that fluff. Yeah, I have to go this way. Yeah, it's kind of hard because I need to go like this. I don't spend too much time just straightening it out so that's okay. Okay. Right. I hope you're able to see me over here. Okay. You see that separation? I'm going to try to get that piece in here. Yeah. 
have to let my fingers start clamping up. So. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay. 